show me cute. Christmas and New Year's are over and I've taken down all those decorations and I've moved on to the next big holiday, which is Valentine's. And I have some new things and some new projects to share with you guys. So let's get started. And the first project, I'm going to show you how I put together this cute little mantle that I love. I started out by hanging my O and my V on the wall. I placed the L and the E on the mantle, and that spells love. Next, I added a little bit of material for softness and my favorite little Cupid. I gave it a little bit of red and added a candle to balance out the height. And then I finished off with the Mercury votives for more softness and balance. For this next project, I'm calling them Glitter Hugs and Kisses, and you just need some paper mache letters, some red craft paint, some red glitter, a paintbrush, and any clear sealer spray. I found this Mod Podge brand, and I highly recommend it. In small sections, you just want to brush on a generous amount of paint. Then add your glitter and tap off any extra. Then repeat this process until your letter is completely covered. I'm using my glitter hugs and kisses for a candy display. I started out by placing a piece of black and white chevron wrapping paper, then added a tray and my letters. Next, I placed a variety of Valentine candies and snacks, and last placed my cute little glitter votives. This is a great idea for a party display. For my final project, I'm going to show you how to take a paper mache letter and give it a faux metal finish. The first thing you need is Martha Stewart brand paint in colors titanium and brushed pewter. You also need a dark brown paint for the edges of your letters, a paintbrush, and a clear sealer spray. First you want to paint your entire surface with the titanium colored paint. Next with a brush and a small amount of the brushed pewter color, you're going to add it to the edges and a little here and there to give some texture to your letter. Then you're going to use a dry paper towel and dab that in just a little bit of the dark brown and rub that gently and very lightly on the edges and the corners of your letter. Last, you're gonna give the whole thing a coat of the sealer spray to give it a nice professional look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you got some good ideas for your Valentine decor this year. And I wanted to ask you what your favorite Valentine's candy is. I really love pull and peels. And don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and leave a comment in the section below. And let me know what your favorite candy is. And we will see you next week. Bye.